Hello there, well good evening, or if you are watching from the United States, a good afternoon and a good morning. If you are in Germany, elsewhere across Europe and across the world, thank you so much for joining us on this Thursday, the 23rd of January, and happy National Pie Day to you. Absolutely, it's National Pie Day, so I don't know whether that means if it's like apple pie, cherry pie, uh, pumpkin pie, whether it is uh, beef pie, beef and onion pie, who knows? That is something that you can be telling me right now, right tonight on Facebook Live. Go across to my Facebook page, whereas I'm on the comments for that one there, but of course we are streaming on all our pages across Facebook. We are also streaming right across YouTube as well, and you can still be uh, interacting on YouTube as well if you've got any questions but more importantly and you know that bang on about it all the time we all do but the best place to be watching us is of course crafters tv head across to crafterscompanion.co.uk dot com or dot eu you can then be watching while you shop that's the best way to do it because we have got an incredible couple of hours lined up for you tonight on cartload so let's go let's go straight in let's have a look to see what we've got coming up tonight Check these out. You've already been buying these and you're popping them into your baskets. Many of you already checked them out. Check out this saving. 45% off. £13 or $21 in the United States. You have got your Element Die Bundle. So this does all your wraparounds when it comes to all your cards and projects. So it is £13, $21 if you are in the United States. There you go. If you are in Europe, you are €21. Euros. Right, then we've got now, I believe this is a first for Cartload, I think we have got Chloe. We've got Chloe with uh, two bundles, you're going to see just within a moment. Um, you've got your butterfly trail, so you're going to be able to choose from the butterfly trails die set or the butterfly die element set. You've got these ones, $7.99 or $7.96, saving a 20%. Prices from $7.99 or $7.96. Then we have got the bloom still with Chloe. So within each one, we'll go in a bit more detail. You get your stamp set, you get your dies that cut into your card as well as out, so you're edgeable, or you've got the ones that die cut individually. So you've got all that selection that you can see on your screen to choose from. Again, all them prices from $7.99 or $7.96 if you're in the United States, saving 20%. Now, of course, you need something to store all your crafty goodies when you're working or out to your craft clubs or travelling. You've got the Crafter's Companion Portable Tote. So this one has all these po products, all these different elements and po pockets to pop all your crafting goodies in. $19.50 in the UK, $15.50 in the United States, a saving of 20%. Now, if you've got that, you're going to want this to go with it as well. So here we are. This is your Crafter Companion tote bag. So this is $11.50 here in the UK, or if you are in the United States, you are going to be $15.50. So many are already just popping that into your basket. Is uh, Just, well, popping that in your basket. You may as well as for that one just there. So there you go, $11.50 in the United States, or... Um, Sometime if we're in the, the UK there, missed that one. Anyway, we've got a third one that would mix and match just beautifully and perfectly with this one. You've got your deluxe tote bag within this one here. $27.50 in the United, United States, $31.50. Uh, I'm going to start that all again because I'm getting my pounds and dollars all mixed up. If you are in the UK, where I am, $27.50. If you are in the United did I say dollars again? Right, let's just go, oh, right, take a debra, take a drink, and let's start that again. Crafter's Companion Deluxe Tote, tote. £27.50 or $31.50 in the United States. That's your saving of 20% in that one. Oh, we'll get there in the end. This is only the start of the night as well. Then, to, to complete it all, we've got the Gemini Wheelie Bag. Look at that one there, £71.50 in the United United. Oh my gosh, we will get this right at one point. £71.50 here in the UK. We have got $95.50 in the United States. Bear with me, it's going to be a bumpy night. Then we've got these ones as well. Now, this is actually incredibly popular here tonight. We've got the Gemini Shaker Die, Shaker Die, £15.50 here in the UK, $20.50 in the United States, a saving of 60%. Thank you, Laura, cheering in my ear there. I'm going to be using these. I'm going to be demoing these, but I'm going to be showing you how you can use these, not just for Christmas, 
But what we're also going to be using with these ones here are the Spectrum Noir Sparkle Pens. You have got six uh, to choose from. There are uh, six in each pack, variety of different colours. You've got Coastal Cottage, you've got Autumn Winter, Floral Gardens, Natural Trails, Spring Summer and Vintage Tones. All of these to choose from. £24.99 here in the UK. £32.00. 95 in the United States or you can get two for £35 or £240. We are going to be incorporating what's coming up. There we go right now. We're going to be doing this uh, quite a few times throughout the night. We have got our clear acrylic, a clear acrylic stamp collection. So we've got your selection to choose from. £7 here in the UK, $8.50 in the United States. You've got two collections to choose from. You've got bundle one, you've got bundle two. We'll be going over them in a lot more detail as the night goes on. Then again, this is another one that you seem to be popping into your basket. This is our fairy garden. This is a relatively new, <coughs> as my throat goes, relatively new collection here at Crafters Companion. Jan launched this here in the UK oh, just before Christmas time, maybe about November time. That full 12 by 12 paper pad, 40 sheets. We're going to be having a closer look at that in a bit more detail later on. 180 GSM, £10. £10 here in the UK, $11.50 in the United States. That's giving you your saving of 20%. Right, so head across to the website. You are going to be, of course, watching uh, while you're shopping. Uh, so just go straight to crafterscompanion.co.uk.com or .eu. Go right to the top. You're going to see the banner for Cartload. Click on that. And as that opens, everything that's going to be on Cartload tonight, and I say everything because there's going to be uh, many things that we're not going to have time to go through, but you can be having a look, checking that out. Do I do suggest that everything is available while stocks last up to 48 hours. Do make sure, like I say, that you get in quick because once it's gone, then uh, yeah, it's gone. Right, so we're going to take that slight, de slight breather. Uh, we've got Facebook up and running. Like I say, we are on my page at the moment. So I want to see what are you popping out your basket? What are you buying? But more importantly, as it's National Pie Day, I want to know what's your favourite pie. Do let me know. No, is it a sweet pie? Is it a savoury pie? What's your favourite? Do you like a bit of apple pie? So... That being said, creel, I, I can't say that word, creel, 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 acrylic stamps. Trust me, can I just say, that is just orange juice. I'm just saying, just saying. So we've got these clear acrylic stamp sets. So we've got two bundles to choose from. Let's have a look at these ones. So these are really nice, quirky sentiment stamps. So we've got this bundle here. So here we go, £7 here in the UK, $8.50 in the United States. So you've got your two bundles to choose from, saving of 25%. So here on this one here, you don't have to be perfect to be beautiful. I'm certainly not perfect tonight, am I? So look at that nice wee sentiment stamp on there. You could be using many of your different ink pads for this one. Then you've got, when you can't find the sunshine, be the sunshine really nice quote nice one just to maybe pop into someone's uh, card or even maybe onto a scrapbook memory page if you want then on this one here let's just bring this one down you've got you'll be as you'll be exactly we'll start the one you will be exactly as happy as you decide to be I remember having trouble with this one the last time I had done. So there we go, that's a nice wee one as well. Then on this one, this is one we're going to be using within the first demo. So if we turn that the right way, we've got uh, Go Make a Fairy Tale and Go Live In It. Such a nice one, works perfectly with the 12 by 12 paper pad on that one. So there we go, so that is bundle one. Then on the next one here, we've got this one here. So I know many of you are going to be loving this one, I just know for sure. We've got Chocolate Doesn't Ask Silly Question, Chocolate Understands. Certainly for me, when it comes to white chocolate, that certainly is the, the issue. Then we've got You've Got This. That's all that it just says, but that's a really good one. You could have that on the front of your card, the inside of your card, it's entirely up to yourself. Then we've got the best antiques are old friends. That's a nice one. So with that one there, one of these days we'll get that in the right way. There we go. So there we are on that one. The best antiques are uh, old friends. That is maybe one that you will have to uh, just gently decide on um, what friend is going to be taking that or that. Well, that's it. Are the old friends, that's the thing. Uh, and then later on in Cartload, we're going to be using this one. It's the little things in life. So that could mean many things uh, for that one there. So that's your two that you could be choosing from. £7 here in the UK, of course, in the United States, you are $8.50. So let's get cracking on. We're going to do this first demo, but what we're going to do is I'm going to show you some samples and then we're going to break the demo up into a couple of chunks so we can be able to show you different products and that, that we're using. So let's have a look at what, this is what we're going to be using or we're going to be making. 
So have a look at this. So I'm going to bring this in. There we go. So this is uh, using many of the products that we've got on Cartload tonight. So going straight to the back first, we've got our glitter card that is on Cartload tonight. We have even got our watercolour card. Look at there on your uh, screen right at the moment, your glitter card. You've got six uh, glitter card sheet packs to choose from, £15 or $23 in the United States. You're getting over 35% off on that one. So this is our non-shed uh, glitter card. You can die cut it, you can emboss it, you can do all these different things. Well worthwhile popping it into your uh, basket. Then, uh, yeah, we've got our uh, smooth card stock. Then look at this pattern background on the back. This is part of our fairy garden. Check out there at the side. So this has got your 40 sheets, all 180 GSM. You've got a mix of background papers as well as toppers, very pastel colours. £10 here in the UK, $11.50 in the United States, giving you the saving of 20%. Then right on the back, just here, we're using the sparkle pens to create this background. So we've used two of them. We'll be going over that in a bit more detail again, just very, very shortly. So we've got the Spectrum Noir sparkle pen, six in each pack, and you've got these ones to choose from. Coastal Cottage, Autumn and Winter, Floral Springs, um, Floral Garden, Nature Trail, Spring, Summer or Vintage Tones. Six of them to choose from, $24.99 here in the UK. $32.95 in the United States, but you're getting two for £35 or two for $40. Then right at the front, here we go, this is where I said, uh, go make a fairy tale and live in it. This is uh, the one that we're going to be using when it comes to uh, doing the front. So what we'll do is let's go straight to the demo. We're going to do the very front. So what I have got here ready, is I've got some of our watercolour cards. So again, going to the website, have a look at card load. You're going to find the details coming up for uh, your watercolour card. Then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to bring my stamping platform. We do have the rocker blocks on uh, card load tonight and they will also work for this. Um, but I had my stamping platform ready to go. So we're going to pop that there. And what I'm just going to do is bring my stamping mat. The stamping mat isn't on card load, but do check out the website to see if it's on there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in our watermark uh, translucent clear. Again, all these ranges are across on our website. So then all that I'm just going to do is I'm just going to tap this, give this a good coverage just like so. Then there we go. So Laura's just telling me the stamp and die collection is in the lead. So if that's something that you are uh, interested in, you want to save and uh, snap up that incredible deal, then do get onto the website. Or of course, if you are watching on Crafters TV, get that checked out. So I'm just pressing this firmly, getting all that detail from the stamp. Then what I'm then going to do is bring in, a, I've just got some embossing powder. So this is white embossing powder. Clear would work as well, but this is just the white. This has got a bit of sparkle in it. So I'm just going to sprinkle that over. Then what I'm just going to do, I am just going to get a bit of cardstock just here. And I'm just going to tip this excess off. So let's tip that onto there and give that a good tip. Don't give it too much of a flick because you don't want any of these particles to fall off. So I'm not sure if you could quite see this. So if I bring that in, so if I just hold it, so but there we go, look at that. So it looks really white, but what we're going to do now is let's just tip this excess back in there. Pop the lid off because you know me, I would probably knock it over. Then I've got my heat gun just to the side. So let's do the heat in. So bring this in. Everything that you're seeing uh, today and tonight on Cartload, I am doing on my glass cutting mat. That is also on the show as well tonight. Have a look at that. So just bringing this in and all that I'm just doing is I'm just getting the heat gun to temperature. So I'm just want to make sure it gets uh, heated up. Then what we're going to do is once I know that's the temp, I'm just going to bring this in and I'm just going to hold that maybe a couple of inches away from the top. Then I'm just going to, as this starts to turn, it starts to melt and go like a, a really soft, clear white. I'm going to move it. If you do want to pop your um, glass cutting mat within your basket, you can see that's 20% off. So this is our large 13 by 19 inch glass cutting mat. We're now $17.50 here in the UK, $23.50 in the United States. Then later on, we're going to be using our white stamping card. So we've got 30% off on that. It's now £20 here in the UK, $30 in the United States. That's a big bundle of cardstock you're getting within that one. One that you could be using for your colouring, your inking, your stamping, your card blanks, anything like that. So we have now 
melted that. So that is now melted. So you're going to see it's still going to be white, but we're going to have a really good sheen. So let's just see if I can get that light just to cut. There we go. Hopefully we can see that. So there we go. Getting that shine with that one there. So that now takes us to that part of uh, the embossing of the stamp. So just to go over it again, that is your stamp. Uh, you've got two bundles to choose from. £7 here in the UK or obviously $8.50 in the United States. So that's a good uh, value for uh, each of those bundles. This is where you're getting your saving of 25% on these ones there. Right, so let's move that to the side at the moment. Let's move that to the side because what we'll do is we'll come back to that in a moment. What we're then going to bring in is the sparkle pens. So they are, you're going to see, they will go just coming up right now. They will go. So we've got six to choose from and in each pack we've got six. So what we'll do is we'll go in a bit more detail coming up. So this is uh, all your different techniques that you can do when it comes to these ones here. $24.99 here in the UK, $32.95 in the US of A, and you're getting two packs for £35 or two packs for $40. Credible, credible deal on that one there. So there we go on this one here. So we've got this one, Coastal Cottage. So if I turn them around, we've got the linen, Peach tree, we've got sea spray, magnolia, we've got corn blue, and we've got pistachio. So that is that one there with your coastal cottage. We've got floral garden. So on this one here, we've got firefly, tangerine, barn red, we've got orchid, we've got pink lemonade, cotton candy. Pop most popular one net so far tonight. This one is in the lead. Then we've got nature trail on this one here. So very, look at all these uh, greens into yellows on these ones here, even with a bit of pinks there. We've got the mushroom, lilac, garden green, watermelon, lychee and sunshine on that one there. So that was the uh, nature garden. Then we've got autumn, winter, very Christmas-esque sort of look, but again, would work for uh, many different occasions, boy cards, girl cards. Autumn, winter on this one here. So we've got smoke, smoke squats, we've got olive jade, we've got harvest moon, starry sky, holly leaf, red berry then we've got spring summer on this one just here then this is where we've got the pink champagne moonlight soft jade we've got solar red emerald green blue topaz and then last but not least we've got the vintage tones and then on the back there it tells you you've got your teacup macaroon we've got biscuit we've got sage we've got peony and we've got the fig on this one there so that is your six to choose from this is where you're getting six in each pack and uh, you're getting two packs for 35 pounds here in the uk or two for 40 dollars in the united states so what we will do is let's bring just a few samples uh, up just to show you the sort of things you could be doing and colouring. So if I bring these ones in just now, so what we're wanting to do is just looking at the butterfly with on these ones here that you can see, getting that bit of a shine and glisten on that one just there. Maybe you've got something like your flowers on this one, the glisten as well. So of course, you don't need to be using our stamps, but I would suggest that you use your uh, Finesse uh, alcohol ink pad. We have got them on cart roads as well. We've got a wee bit of a bundle when it comes to them, so check them out. Then here's one using um, another stamp range that we've had at Crafters Companion, but just done a bit of a wash over the back, something similar that I'm going to be doing, so that shows you that one as well. And then last but not least, what about doing sort of a split spritzing effect on the background? Like a wash with a spritz over the back, you've got that one just there. So that is just a few different ones that you can be doing when it comes to the sparkle pens. So let's crack on. We're going to move on to the next bit when it comes to that demo. So many are jumping up on Facebook. Thank you so much. We will come on just shortly and have a look and have a read to see what you're all saying. So what we want to do is we're going to bring this back in. I have got some water and I've also got some, uh, I've got one of our paintbrushes and I've also got our uh, sparkle pens. So on this one here, we have got your uh, peony and then we've also got the this one here, sage green. So this is from your autumn and winter and your summer, uh, spring and summer. So autumn and winter and summer, spring on this one here. So that's the two that I've got there. So what we're going to do then, I'm also just going to bring just a bit of kitchen roll. So I'm going to give this a good coverage of water. So this is our watercolour card, so this is where you're able to do all of this. Straight onto our glass cutting mat, as you can see. So really give that a good coverage, just like so. And because we've obviously melted that heat embossing powder, that'll be, even with the water, it'll start to resist it. So let's just finish that off, give that 
straight across with the brush. So there you go, if you want your watercolour pack, you can get 30% off on that one there. So it's only £8 here in the UK or uh, $12.50 in the United States. That's three packs for that one. Three packs, absolutely incredible. So all that I'm just doing is just giving this a wee bit of a shake just to activate all that sparkle inside. Just quickly as well, if there is anything specific you want straight off to the website, don't forget, just pop in that number right to the top and that'll take you straight to the product. If there is only one specific product, but I know what you like. You want to jump in there, you want to have a look on Cartload and see everything that's available for you to pop into your basket, especially at these incredible savings. Right, so what we're going to do then is let's start with the peony. So all that I'm going to do, again, just quickly, let's just give that just another wee bit of a wash over with water. So I'm then just going, I'm just going to lightly squeeze this, then just over the top, I'm just going to squeeze and I'm just going to let that fall out onto the paper. Then I'm just going to take my paintbrush again, just dabbing off uh, some of the excess water, and I'm just going to start to work my way down like so and see that i'm starting to blend that color ombre effect all the way down starting to go from dark all the way down to the light then what i'm going to do is now take in the soft jade and i'm going to do exactly the same but what i'm going to do is maybe just about halfway and i'm just going to squeeze slightly as i'm wiping it over then again taking the paintbrush then I'm just going to start in the middle with the paintbrush and then I'm just going to go back and forwards. So I'm just going to pick that colour up. If you need to go back with more of your water, then you can do. So I'm just going to go back right down to the bottom. Then I'm even just going to go at the top again. I'm just going to come all the way down, start to kind of like seamlessly blend all of that. Then what I'm just going to do is let's just wipe that excess off it for the time being. Take an earth heat tool and I'm just going to start to help this dry off. So let's get this going. Then what you're going to find as well is we're going to bring in a wee special tool. So you're going to find this coming up as well. So this is our crimper. So we're going to be using that. So we're going to see there. So this is the tool I'm going to be using. Have a look, 25% off our essential tool collection. So it was £20.47 here in the UK. Uh, or $30.39. And now look at that. Here in the UK, £15 or £22.50. Uh, $22 so this is where you get your edge crimper, you also get your six inch scissors, and you also get your three pack of low tack tape. Great one to pop into your basket and have within your crafty stash. Now, before this fully dries, what I'm just going to do is switch that off, then, so this is still damp, especially around the edges. So what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to hold it just kind of like in between my thumb and my last finger and I'm just going to go along. So because it's still damp all the way around, I'm just like that, crimp it. I'm just starting to break down the fibres like so and I'm just distressing that edge. So what I'm going to do is carry on and I'm just going to work my way around. So as you can see, I'm not being neat, I'm not being tidy, I'm not being specific. I'm just letting it go as it wants, I'm letting it tear as it wants, I'm letting it ruffle as it wants. I'm just going to work my way all the way around, like so. Parts that doesn't miss, I'm not being bothered, I'm just rush, rushing and just ruffling it up. Then what we can even do is start to even just turn in the corners if we want, back and forwards a bit. Really kind of make it a wee bit of a distressed look. But what I'm also then just going to do is just into the middle there, just with my kitchen cloth, I'm just going to, it's kind of a bit like buffing it up, so I'm just going to take any of that excess colour that's sitting. Then what I'm going to do is, if I bring that in closer for you to see, so we have got that two-tone distressed background with the colour, and then we've got the distress all the way around the edges using the crimper. So that's from the Essential Tool Collection. So that is that one there. So that's how I've created that background. So that's me showed you how to do the stamping as well as uh, creating the background. So that is with that one. So then what we're going to do is we're going to then assemble the card. We're going to pop that together. So let me show you some of the glitter card. We'll show you the paper pad as well. So let me bring these in. So let's have a look at the fairy garden. So this is our 12 by 12. This is part of our nature's garden collection. So here we'll go check that out. There we go. You've got that right down the side just there. £10 here in the UK. That's incredible. £10 or $11.50. Absolutely awesome. So within this one here. So with this paper pad here, 
I've opened one side, not the other. So let's just open this one. So this one is, it's 12 by 12. You've got 40 sheets, it's 180 GSM. Now what you're going to see with this one here, you've kind of got the holographic sort of look. So it's all that glaze, that glitter's been done for you, but it's encapsulated. So you've got full double-sided sheets. Many of them are full on scene. So if you want to use them as home decor, create frames, put them into a little girl, a little boy's bedroom, then you can do. But if I flip this over, this is what I mean by double-sided. Now look at that encapsulation. Look at that shimmer on that one there. So it's all done for you on that one there. So there we go. As you can see on that one there, so you're getting three sheets with each. Now you're getting pattern. And you're getting a good selection of different patterns, scenes, uh, glittered, encapsulated, so much more. So if I skip right to the back right there, so look at all these colours. They all work together, they all coordinate, they all complement each other. Very spring-like uh, pastel colours with your greens, you've got your pinks, you've got your lilacs, you've got your yellows. Look at all these. Now look at that. That's just shouting out to be a scrapbook page. Just maybe a wee photo and the wee name, you know, of the little girl or little boy on this case. Then you can be doing that as well. Well, die cut them, fussy cut certain bits, you know, fussy cut all them. All these are kind of like encapsulated, all that glitter, all that sparkle, sparkle within them. So working their way. So as you can see, we've got the double sided all the way through on that one just there. So that's what I'm going to be using for one element. And then not to forget, because I did forget, you've actually got your toppers. So if I bring that back down, there we go. So you've actually got toppers as well. So you've got two sheets of a variety of different toppers and then another two sheets as well. Lots of sentiments, all die cut, all frames within out as well. So there we go. So for all of that, for £10 or $11.50, that is absolutely amazing. Then glitter card, here we go. So they are £15 here in the UK, $23 in the United States. You're getting the saving of 35%. So you're getting your six packs on this one, which are going to include all these ones, all on your screen at the moment. But then look, have a look at these ones here. So we've got 250 GSM, 10 sheets in total in each one. And they are also going to complement our Centura Pearl range. So we've got baby blue, we've got baby pink, we've got copper, we've got lilac, we've got solar gold, and we've got Xmas green. But of course, we know that it could be for any type. So there you go. Originally here in the UK, $23.94, but you are now £15. Absolutely incredible. So there we go. So just got the uh, sparkle pins back on the elf. We're going to finish off with this card now. So let's bring in some bits and pieces all here ready to go. Then I'm just going to take my pokey tool for the time being. So I've already cut my layers down so you can see. Then you'll find adhesives on the website as well. But I've got my double sided tape of course on the back. So all that I'm just going to do is we're just going to layer them up. So for anyone wanting to know this size here is just bring it down just like for a minute six and a half inches. Then my next layer, I've just used white smooth cardstock, which is on cartload as well. But if you do want a bit of that texture effect, you could still use your watercolour card as well. Don't forget the watercolour card doesn't just have to be for doing uh, your watercolouring. Then what I'm going to do is bring in my baby pink. Now, as you can see, I've already pre-got the centre of this because I don't want to waste it because we're not going to see it. So there we go. Just taking all these off as well. Let's just take this one off like so. Then I'm just going to take a bit of my tacky glue. So this is our glitter card, it's encapsulated. However, because I'm using the double-sided tape, what I do want to do is I just want to add just a wee bit of our tacky glue because what will happen is once I place this over the glitter card, it's going to soak into the glitter card and it's going to secure it even better. So there we go. Once it's dry, the layers are adhered together and we will then be secure so there we go so let's just pop that on like so press that into place so the tape will still hold it while the glue dries then let's just take the last layers off of these ones so working our way around if you've got your tape runners you could be using that as well tape runners are on cartload as well check them out on the website bring it in my card blank now you know and you hear me say this often enough this is before i tape that down so in total, this is seven inch, these layers, but this card blank is actually eight inches. 
Don't be scared, don't be worried, and don't be afraid to actually have white space, because you're going to see that this is going to look quite effective having that white border. So if you do want to use your tape pens, 10% off, you're getting 22 metres in total. So there you go, your price right down at the bottom there, £3.50 or $5 in the United States. So that's a great one to have as well. So let's pop that on like that. Then all that we're just going to do is I'm just taking what I've just done. So I would still leave this to dry just this wee bit longer, but still it will be absolutely fine. And let's just take our tacky glue again as well. Just pop that into the back. But what I'm not going to do is I'm not going to do edge to edge. I'm just going to pop that into the middle and let's just pop that just kind of like at an angle like so. I'm going to leave these edges hanging over the edge like so. Then what I'm just going to do is take, I've already taken a ribbon, just in case you want, because everyone asks me how do I do it. So this is how I do the ribbons. So I just fold them in half like so, cross them over, and then pull them under like so. So that's how. So for those that are on uh, Facebook or Instagram and go, Craig, you don't really tie your bows, do you? Yes, I do. I do indeed. So there we go. So that's how we do them, just for anyone that wants to know. So just tightening that up. Then let's just take our six inch scissors, not forgetting these were in the essential tool collection. So that's where you get your paper crimper as well as your uh, three rolls of low tack tape. So let's pop that there to the side. We can finish this off. So what we're just going to do is we're just going to use our uh, Colal glue gel. Again, you'll find that on the website. Anything like that that's not on the cartload lineup, you will find on the website. And then let's just pop this last bit on. Then what I've done is just using Sarah's vintage lace collection. I've taken a butterfly. We're going to pop that on. However, you will find, if you've noticed already, there is some incredible detailed butterflies within the Chloe sets we've got on cartload tonight. So you could be using one of them if you wanted. So there we go. Let's just finish that one off. Pop that to the side. There we go. Go make a fairy tale and go live in it. So there we go, other than the layers that I'd already cut to size, we have made that right from the start. So we used the sparkle pens on the background. We also used the watercolour card. Uh, we used the stamp as well. Then on the layers, we've used the uh, fairy garden pattern paper. We've used the smooth white cardstock and we've used the glitter card as well. And then, yeah, once again, there you go. So you'll see your clear acrylic stamp collection. So you can choose from two collections, uh, £7 here in the UK or $8.50 in the United States. So there we go. So a card that's near enough been made from start to finish uh, within the start of cartload. So there we go. So that is how we made that one. Now, okay. So, when it comes to the deals, don't forget, maybe you didn't already know that here at Crafters Companion, we've got our, it's kind of our loyalty club. So it's all about the more you spend, you like to give something back. So the more you spend, the more sort of tiers that you go up. The more tiers you go up, the more discount, the more deals, the more benefits that you get as well. And trust me, they really, really good uh, deals and benefits to come along with it. But you don't want to hear that from me. You'll want to hear from our self -dope is coming back in a few days but have a look at the uh, the video we've got for you from Sarah telling you all about Club Inspire. Welcome to Club Inspire, our free loyalty club. As a member of the club you can save up to 20% every time you shop with us. For every pound you spend, whether it's in one of our stores or on our website, you'll collect one loyalty point. The more points you have, the more benefits you'll receive. As a welcome present, we'll give you 20% discount with your very first order. Once you place your first order, you'll be given 250 points straight away, making you a bronze member. This will mean that you'll receive a 5% discount on all of your purchases until the end of the next calendar year, plus priority postage. 500 points takes you up to silver membership, where you'll get 10% discount, plus free shipping when you spend over £20. When you get to 750 points, you'll become a gold member, which gets you a whopping 15% discount on every order and will ship them to you completely free, no matter how big or small they are. Spend over £25 and we'll send them to you via our premium next day delivery courier service. 
when you reach 1500 points, you'll become a Platinum member, giving you the same shipping benefits as a Gold member, but with the added bonus of a massive 20% discount on all of your purchases. Now on top of that, you'll receive exclusive discounts, sneak peeks of brand new products, special offers and money saving vouchers. You'll have access to an exclusive secret Facebook group to meet like-minded friends, to find out information first and to be inspired by all the crafty makes. We'll send you a completely free quarterly Digimag direct into your inbox giving you lots of hints, tips, inspiration, additional offers and some sneaky behind the scenes gossip from the team. So what are you waiting for? Become a member of our club today. There you go. Kathy Fox, I've never actually tried cherry pie before, uh, so that's someone or something that I would need to uh, have a look at and try uh, Try them. Uh, many pies that I've tried. One that is a personal favourite too, Laura in my ear, she does love her pumpkin pie. I wasn't a fan until she made it just at Halloween last year and I have to admit, it was actually rather good. Was rather good. Right, what's everyone saying? Let's go on and have a look. So don't forget, as we're talking about pie, in case you've just joined us, uh, I should maybe just explain, it's uh, National Pie Day. So I want to know what is, uh, yeah, in case you just think that we're just randomly talking about pies. Uh, we're not, well we are, but there's a reason to it. Um, National Pie Day, so do let us know what your favourite pie is. Um, uh, Marge from Illinois is just saying hello. Many of you from um, all over the United States, from Houston, Arizona, California, California, uh, Somerset, Tracy from Scotland, woo woo. Um, we've got Bettina from Denmark, um, so many uh, just tuning in, thank you so much. Oh, it's saying Denise Lair's watching, hi mum, she's probably gone off by now, she's usually out on a Thursday night, shouldn't say that, but we're friends. Uh, we've got Linda saying uh, peach pie, peach pie, peach pie, Pe peach cobbler maybe, or maybe, is that kind of like, um, like an apple crumble but with peach on the top mm, sounds good i like peaches uh tracy rhubarb pie oh yeah oh squirty cream not the real cream you know that synthetic squirty cream on the top don't know if you get that <gasps> marion my absolute favorite lemon meringue pie oh uh, key lime pie, Lord is saying as well, absolutely, the tangier the better, absolutely. Uh, Jeffrey, pumpkin pie, um, Patty is saying American apple pie, uh, Eric, strawberry pie, I've heard of strawberry, strawberry tarts or that, I've never heard of a big strawberry pie, uh, Julia saying strawberry rhubarb pie, fantastic, absolutely. Um, uh, a good old steak and ale, yep, although with Laura you would probably take out the steak and then just leave it at the ale. Um, right, okay, no, thank you so much for uh, tuning in tonight or of course uh, afternoon, morning, wherever you're watching from the United States, I appreciate your company, so many of you tuning in, we'll come back to Facebook again later on, thank you for your lovely comments about that card, I'm so glad that you like it, I had so much fun that other night making it. Right, when you've got your crafty products, you will of course need something to store them in, or if you've got a craft cob, you need somewhere to take them in. We have something special, we have got our wheelie bags. So bring in this one in. Look at this one, 20% off this one here. So that's your 20% off, 71.50 here in the UK. If you're in the United States, $95.50. I'm going to move that out of the way because my arm will probably knock it over. So we have got our full, you can just about see me, I'll go on my tiptoes a bit. You have got your full four wheels, so they rotate 360 all the way around. Tell you what we'll just do, um, oh, Laura's probably shouting at me because got that angle from the, the uh, camera oh well uh, anyway so we've got our four wheels so 360 so we can see as well it turns all the way around we've got the extendable handle goes all the way up so high up that I can't quite get to the top but there we go so it does that we've got the opening bag so if we turn it all the way around have a look inside and we're just going to work that round so Opening this up, we have got all these pockets. Now what will happen here, if I lift it, now I know you're not going to be able to quite see this, so I will tip it forward. So what you can actually do is, if I bring that close up, I wonder if I can see this. Just so you can see the actual, so there we go. So let's just clip that on. So you've actually got two, so these actually clip to the handle. I'll just do the one just now. Then what we're going to do is, if I bring that in, look at that one there. So can you just see, if I hold it up, there we go. Can you see? So you've got the two as well, so that would clip as well. So if I, if you've got that sitting, so you can see that will then just sit 
holding that bag open, that lid open. You've got all these pockets as well, all zip pockets, clear in the front here. It's all wipeable. All the material is uh, washable as well, wipeable, washable. The zips, you've got this bit here. Now, this is the good bit, so let's take that off just now and that off. Let's lower that and then show you this. Now, look at the Velcro at the side here. So if I turn that round, look at all of that. Now, look how tough this is. Oh. Now, it's like that for a reason. So is the other side, because what will happen is we've got that shell. Look how sturdy, or here sturdy that is. What will happen, you can of course do it to different levels, but, see this is the problem when you're doing it back to front. You can then pop this in, and then your Gemini Junior, or your Gemini will sit in it as well. So your Gemini can sit in the bottom, then you can put this to the right height, you can put your cardstock, you can put your plates on, you can do all these different things as well. Again, inside, it is wipeable. Pop your Gemini inside, and then we've even got the clips as well. So we've got the elastic clips that would wrap around your Gemini, hold in place like so, and you've got your pockets as well, the zips and that as well. All of that within that full bag there, 71.50 here in the UK, $95.50 in the United States. That's where you're getting your saving of 20%. So that's a good one to have, especially when you're out and about. You don't even just have to use that with that crafting. If you don't want to, you can use it elsewhere. Right, so we're going to be using the deluxe tote bag. So that is um, the, this one here. So here we go. So this is a good one here. So this one also holds your Gemini Junior. So let's open in this one. So we've all got these as well. So we carry our stuff about whether it's to classes if we're doing them or if we're doing them, um, if we're at TV, then we take all our stuff around. Then what we've got in here. So we've got these compartments that have got the strong Velcro as well. And then popping them in like so. Then we've got these different ones here, just here using the Velcro, so you can create all your own uh, separate uh, pockets. So if you do want to put individual plates, your large plates, then they can go into the middle. Then we've got your different pockets as well. But like I say, you can take that one out, you can take that one out, you can take that one out and leave it like that. So many different ways, not forgetting, we have got all these different pockets all the way around here, as well as the zip pocket. That will hold your uh, plug for your Gemini Junior if you use it for that one. So head across to the website because we've got other deals on uh, more of our storage as well. So it's all across there. So if we get a chance later on, we'll come back and look at them. But all of them are across on the website, crafterscompanion.co.uk.com or .eu. Again, if you're watching, you can be shopping. If you're watching us on Crafters TV. Right, this is what we're going to be showing you next. This is all about the shaker dies. This is flying out tonight. I'm not surprised. Saving the 60%. This is your die stamp and uh, your Gemini stamp and die Christmas collection. So you've got uh, two collections each that include uh, three stamps and a full die set. You're loving this one. So it's £15.50 here in the UK or $20.50 in the United States. You've got two sets, two collections to choose from. We're going to be showing you them just shortly. But what you're going to see within the demo coming up shortly a couple of them you don't necessarily have to use for Christmas. Right, so if we we'll have a quick look at the bundle one, so this is uh, bundle one, this is where you've got your Christmas ornaments on this one here. So we'll go in a bit more detail if you're new to them later on, what you can actually do with them. But this enables you to create your actual shaker card. So as you can see, you've got your dies as well as your uh, coordinated stamps along the top. Then on this one here, we have got the Christmas stocking, although my demo is going to be using this one and it's not going to be a Christmas stocking. Then we've got the Christmas tree on that one there. So there we go, that is your bundle one for that one there. £15.50 here in the UK, $20.50 in the United States. Then uh, bundle two, we have got your uh, celebration on this one here. I call it a celebration. So this could be a cocktail glass, gin glass, wine glass. It could be a prong cocktail glass, could be anything really. You've got your dies and you've also got your stamp set on the top. Then we have got your, uh, it's your window scene on this one. Again, this one doesn't necessarily, as well as this one, doesn't have to be Christmas. You can uh, theme it elsewhere. And then you've also got your snow globe. Once again, yeah, you think of uh, Christmas and snow globes, but you could do it any way that you want. £15.50 here in the UK, $20.50 in the United States. That's, that's where you are getting your uh, saving of uh, 60%. And then just say, also check out on Cartload as well. Have a look as well because your sequence works perfectly when it comes to the shaker card so they are all on offer as well so let's have a look at a few samples see the sort of things you can make so we've got let's take 
One, two, and let's go for this one. So here we go, we're going to be using the bobble on this one just here. So there we go, this is where we've created the shaker. So I am just going to turn it just slightly so you can see. So this is where you've got your shaker element, but you could be using them on their own if you want. You don't necessarily have to use them as shaker. Then we have got the Christmas stocking. Actually, a few of the sequins have fallen out on this one, but it lets you see how you can uh, create and make your shaker cards. And then again, this is uh, using the Christmas tree. So that one actually, all three that I've showed you is actually using the shaker card in the element and in the way to create the actual shaker object. I'm going to show you a different way. But once again, what we're going to do is we're kind of going to break it up into different um, segments or sections. So we're going to start off the demo using the shaker elements. However, what we're going to do is we're going to use the sparkle pens to create the background. And that'll show you a slightly different way of how to actually use. So do you want to see what we're going to make? So we are going to make this easel shaker card. We are using the glitter card that is on cartload. And we're also using the stamps. We're using the sparkle pens, the sequins, the uh, stocking um, dies as well. So, so much more. Yeah, the glitter card, the uh, watercolour card, and then I've just added my own sentiments, but there you go. So we're going to be using that. So a stocking, but it could be a new baby card. Right, so what we're going to do first is let's take our watercolour card. I've already die cut this to the, uh, the circle size that I want. Then what I'm just going to do is take in my two colours, so with the two blues that I've got on this one here, so Starry Sky and Teacup. So your Starry Sky, just this one here, I've got it written down, is from the Vintage Tones, and then your Teacup is from Floral Gardens. So just quickly give them a bit of a shake as well. So there we go, have a look on it, right on the side there. So you're getting uh, each, there's six packs to choose from. You're getting six sparkle pens in each pack, but you're getting two packs for £35 or two packs for $40. So look at that. So if we go at the dollars, look at that. You're getting two for 40 However, one pack is $32.95. There you go. There you go. Need I say more? Right, so, and then just obviously for the UK, you can see yours is two for £35. However, for one pack, you're at $24.99. You know, great saving. Unreal saving. Right, so what we've got is, let's go for the Starry Sky. Using my glass cutting mat, I'm going to put that into back so you can see it properly because I moved it earlier. So all that I'm just doing is, I'm just going to give that a bit of a squeeze and we're just going to pick that up. Now, I do have just that slight bit of excess. Usually I wouldn't bother, but because that's a deeper color of a blue, I just want to get rid of some of that. Then all that I'm going to do with the lighter one, so it's your teacup, let's just squiggle that on as well. So we're going to get a wee bit of a similar background as before. However, it's showing you how you can use your spritzer bottle. All these sorts of tools from Spectrum Noir are on the website as well. So all that I'm going to do is just spritz that with water. So even on the glass mat, can you just see how that starts to feather out and falls out like so? Then I'm just going to take my circle, my die cut circle again, this is the watercolour card, and I'm just going to tap it. Now can you see instantly that sort of marble effect you're going to get? So let's just pick all that up like that. And then all that I'm going to do is getting all that excess up. Now you can keep going and going and going, but I'm going to leave it like that because I, it reminds me of like a, a planet all these different tones. So what I'm going to do is leave it to the side at the moment. I'm not going to spend too long doing this. However, I do just want to show you what you can then do is just keep going, just picking up the excess that you've got, then go over so as you can see there, that sort of look that you got. Use it for your backgrounds, use it for doing your die cutting. Why not let it dry and then run it through your embossing folders. Use your gilding wax. Gilding wax is on um, craft load as well tonight. So picking that up. So you can see where I'm going. The more you do it, the more you use, the lighter it's going to get. So what we'll just do is, usually when I'm at home, obviously I wouldn't be wasting all this. However, we do um, get rid of it for time. So let's take in that out the way, like that. Let's move this into the middle there. Let's just take our heat gun as well. And then I'm just going to let this go to temperature. Now you might think, because of the effect that we've done, because of the um, kind of, you would think it's kind of like diluting it down with the uh, actual uh, spritz bottle, that we're going to lose some of that sparkle. Absolutely not. No way at all. So what we're just going to do is we're just going to slightly dry this off. 
Ideally, I would keep going until it's fully dry, but just for time, I will stop in a short while. But there we go, as you can see everything so far I've done on my glass cutting mat. This is where you're getting 20% off. This is a 13 inch by 19 inch glass cutting mat. It was uh, originally here uh, in the UK, $21.99. You're now $17.50. Or in the United States, you were originally $29.95. You're now $23.50. So there we go, great saving on that one as well. So as it starts to bow slightly, I'm just going to turn that over, just heat the back just to flatten that out. So then there we go. So that's given us our sort of spritz flow, flow bleaching effect when it comes to the sparkle. So there we go. So if I bring that in, I just want to let you see the close up just so you can see the sparkle. So even using it with the spritz bottle. There we go, there we are, just perfect. Look at all that sparkling all the way through. There we go. So, what we're then going to do is bring in our actual die set. So this one here is, this is where I'm using the Christmas stocking. So I'm going to be using this one here. So let you see, all together, you're getting 17 elements. So you're getting all these dies down at the bottom. Then you're getting all these stamped sentiments along the top as well to finish it off. Then you've got the wee tag down at the bottom there and you're even getting your wee sentiment tags just at the top there. It says to and from. So you can make your own ones. So let's see how this all works. So let's use our Gemini Junior plates for this one here. Then I'm also wanting, I'm going to use some of the baby blue glitter card as well. So first things first, let's create the shaker element. So we're going to use both the actual dies, one inside the other. So popping it onto our glass mat, then we're going to be popping that there. If you are in the look for a new die cutter machine, an electronic one, we have got the Gemini Junior on uh, the show as well tonight. So check that out. You can see that uh, just coming up on your screen, or it's on the website, 20% off the Gemini Junior. So it's £111.50 here in the UK or $159.50 if you are in the United States. Don't forget, you get all the plates with that and you also get your uh, starter set. So you get some dies to start you off. You get a create a card die, you get a border die. You also get your sort of like your hexagon mixed media dies. You get your uh, 3D embossing folder die as well. So you get a good selection to start you off. The plates will always be your two cutting plates, your plastic shim, your magnetic shim, your um, metal shim and then also your rubber embossing mat they all come included so there we go so let's take all these elements out the way so even that there that would be waste but you could use that as a stencil or something that you could be using elsewhere as well but we don't need that this is the bit that we actually need so this is now die cut that aperture part of the stocking so let's then bring in our uh, distressed background using the sparkle inks. So taken on this occasion, we want the smallest one. We want the inside one because we want to be over to overlay the actual uh, die on top. So let's place that on. And then I'm just going to tape that down in place like that. Then what we're going to do is run that through. That's then going to create that aperture for us to then pop that actual like, die cut glitter card frame out. Then what we can do is pop that out. So again, you could be using this one elsewhere if you so wish, but we will pop it to the side for now. So there we go. So this has got our aperture within there. Then what I'm going to do is we're just going to take some of our uh, tacky glue you could use your red liner tape if you want. That's entirely up to yourself, but we're just going to use the tacky glue for now. Then I'm just going to just pop that all the way around just lightly. If you've got any of the small applicators, they'd be good as well because you've got the fine tip. However, with these ones, you do get a good coverage with the tip. So let's just, I'm just going to dab just a wee bit of that excess off my hand. Then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to overlay that. So I'm just overlaying that where I've created that aperture. So that gives us that nice frame of the stocking. There we go, taping that down. So there we go. Now, collection two is the most popular when it comes to these shaker cards. So uh, yeah, you're loving the collection two on these ones here. So there we go. So this is where we've now got the background. We've also got that aperture within the middle just there. Then what we're going to do is bring in a bit of acetate 
and we're going to use some red liner tape. We're going to pop this over the back. So I'm going to take my six inch scissors. Again, these are part of the uh, tool collection. Have a look at that. You've got the six inch scissors, you've got your edge crimper, and you have also got your three rolls of low tack tape. There you go, bottom of your screen, 25% off the tool collection. You're now 15 pound or $22.50 in the United States. Again, don't forget, this is where you're getting your six inch scissors. So this is the medium sized ones that we do. When um, Leanne had them done, you know, she went to, you know, the, the professionals when it get, came to get our scissors done. When it comes to that, when it comes to the guillotine, if you are fans of a guillotine, check out the website. She went to an actual sword manufacturer, not a blade company, a sword manufacturer. So we have got the sharpest, the best blades. Right, so what I'm going to do is pop that on. If you are in the uh, market for a guillotine, check out the small guillotine. The, that is on cartload as well. So this is where the actual blade, well, I say the blade, it's actually uh, been done by a sword company, a sword manufacturer. So there we go. Peeling that off, taking these off. So then what I'm just going to do is taking that last bit off of the red liner tape. So peel that. We will get there in the end. Let's go this side. There we go, we'll get there in the end. Right, let's really, thanks Laura, appreciate that. There we go, we'll get there, we'll get there, there we go, we got there. Don't often struggle with the back ends, but I did there. Right, so what I've just done here is I've just got a bit of acetate, so I'm just going to pop that over. You're not going to see the back, so I'm not being um, neat while I trim it. I'm just going to get rid of those excess edges, just so that they can't be seen. And then what to do is have a look on the website to see for our shaker tape. Anything like that would be uh, on the website. You're going to want that for doing the shaker element. I have just got these um, foam pad strips. So all that we're going to do is, for time, I would be really neat and tidy and go around all the edges of the actual um, aperture part. But... I'm just going to be really quite quick because, uh, again, I'm conscious of time. But what you want to do is each part, you really want to press that and butt that up to the edge of each other. So if I bring that close up for you to see. So if you have a look, just there, there is no gaps. There is no gaps at all. So that means when we put our uh, sequence or glitter, anything like that on, it's not going to fall out. So we're just going to carry on doing that again just working our way all the way around, just ensuring, whatever way that you do it, just ensuring that you have got no gaps. So again, like you say, I'm just being really quick, but the thing with our uh, foam on a roll, that can go round corners, just spend a bit more time doing that. So let's just finish this one off, just making sure each edge is all right up against each other, so nothing's going to fall out. So Pop that right up there, again, right up to the side, just like that, and there we go. And then what I'm going to do is get rid of that excess. I'm just going to put just a couple of bits there just to balance that out like that. And then what we can then do, popping that there. Uh, many on Facebook are saying you're absolutely loving the storage bags. I'm not surprised. That is certainly, uh, now is the time to get them, that's for sure. Right, so what I've got is my uh, back end just like that. Then I've got just a bit of white cardstock just here, so it's a wee bit smaller than the back end. So what I'm then going to do just now is let's peel the back end off of all of these. So that means we're ready to go, taking all the back end off the 3D foam, like that. So yeah, the storage is great, whether you go to craft clubs, whether you have to store your crafty goodies in maybe a cupboard or something, and you have to bring it all out each day to the living room or the dining room, then you can be uh, just popping it all into the storage caddies and that and bringing it out as and when you need. So what I'm then going to do is I've just got some of my sequins just here. I've got blue topaz. So all that I'm just going to do is I'm just going to pour that within the middle, just like that like so then i'm just going to just press that out i'm just going to spread that out as well like that 
There we go. So there we go. We've got the, right at the bottom, you see, you've got the guillotine. And then coming up just so, shortly, have a look at the side. We've got the sequins. Eleven fifty here in the UK, $15.80 in the United States. So you're getting your five bags of sequins. We'll show you them just shortly. But eleven fifty or $15.80. So what I just want to do is I just want to make sure I'm getting that within the center of my sort of aperture of the stocking like that, because I want to make sure that I don't get any of the sequins under the foam, like that. So once we're there, I'm just going to press into place, holding that in. Doesn't matter if the back's not straight, because you're not going to see that. So let's just hold that in place. So there we go. We've now got, if I bring that in for you to see, we've now got our sequins that would then fall all the way around. That's using the blue topaz. So there we go, there it is, your blue themed for your baby boy on that one there. And that is how you can then create that shaker element when it comes to your shaker cards. So that is that one. And then what we can just do is start to bring it all together. You can see here, we've also got these ones here. So we have got the top of the uh, stocking. And we've also got these parts here. So a bit like eyes, but they're actually for like the heel and the toe of the stocking stocking so there we go let's pop them to the side because we've got them already cut so we've got them there them there and them there then what i'm also going to do is let's bring these different parts in i've got some of my glitter card i've got my baby blue glitter card and i've got one of the stamp sets as well so what i'm then going to do is i've just taken just a bit of excess uh, that i had left over when i done it at home die cut that in a circle using the white smooth cardstock i've just created a layer for that then i'm using the stamp set for this one just here so this one here is set from your bundle two it's the little things in life then what i'm going to do is pop that onto our stamping platform like that so there we go so we have got a clear acrylic stamps so you've got two sets to choose from on these ones here so you've got seven pound or eight dollars fifty in the united states uh saving of 25 percent awesome saving on that one so then i'm just going to take my stamping platform there and then i'm going to be using my uh, alcohol proof die so this is the uh, noir black for this one here now i'm just going straight over just onto the white smooth cardstock and i'm not adding color however if you were stamping with an actual um, image and you want to color it in with a tri-blend pens or classics anything like that then what you're going to be doing is using the alcohol proof die so what we're going to do is stamp that out we've actually got uh, a bundle with our ink pads so we're going to show you them just in a moment then let's bring this one in and then i'm just going to stamp that line that up and press now that's going to be that's alcohol proof so if you were to add color then we can do so let's bring that one just there so there we go so there's that one there let's have a look at the actual bundle that is uh, available Artload tonight when it comes to the ink pads so we've got these ones just into here so this is where we've got this is our waterproof ones so this is where if you want to do your stamping of an image and then come along and uh, color them in with any of your water base sort of your uh, aqua markers anything like that sparkle pens uh, using your uh, water techniques you can be using that so there we go so that is your waterproof dye noir black on that one just there so that's that one then you're also getting your rustic brown exactly the same but this is the brown then you're also getting your waterproof dye this is your uh, flagstone again exactly the same concept but on that one there and then on this one here you're getting your uh, pebble so a bit more of a lighter dye on that one there so there we've got brown pebble all of that one just there and uh, you've got that 60 percent off so all of them just there that is 14.96 here in the uk 22.47 in the us of a you know, for our Spectrum Noir finesse alcohol or our waterproof ink pads, incredible saving. Right, let's bring these ones in. Let's just use our tacky glue just for this one. We'll start to finish this off. Right, so we've now got that layered up just like so. Then what I'm just going to do very quickly, let's bring in the guillotine. Now, I'm going to use a small one. I'm going to show you how to create the easel. So I've got our uh, glitter cards. So I've die, die cut three circles exactly the same. 
then all that I'm going to do is using the scoring board elements on the actual uh, guillotine that you go right down the bottom of your screen, 70% off. I'm just going to be uh, roughly scoring it in half. So it's five and a half. So I'm going to go for two and a half. Let's go two and let's go three quarters. So half roughly. And then just maybe... Uh, half an inch or so down to the side, just there. So there's your small guillotine. So it's your 8.75 by your 5.5 by 7.5 on this one here. And that's where you've got 19.50 here in the UK or $27.50 in the United States. So there we go. So all that I'm just doing here is, so I folded it in half like that. And then I've also created this wee bit just at the end here, which also creates and folds just like so. So then just quickly, let's take our tacky glue for this one. Just a bit on that edge, just there. If we open that up, like so. Then I'm just going to line that all up and I'm just going to press that edge just to the end there, like so. So what that's going to do, holding that in, that's going to then create that element just there. And then what I'm going to do is just on this half here, Let's just add just a wee bit more glue, like that. Then what we're going to do is, just going to pop that on top, like so. So just holding that down. Right, so what we're going to do then is hold that in place. So this is the glitter card that we've just been using just there. So you're going to see that popping up as well. So you're getting all these different sheets in total. It includes your baby blue. You're also getting your baby pink. You're getting copper. You're getting a uh, lilac, solar gold. You're also getting your Christmas green. All of that £15 here in the UK or if you're in the United States, $23 within that one. So this is where you're getting 35% saving off within this one here. Right, just using our adhesive, all that I've just done is just pop that onto the back and we're going to place that over the top like so, just like that. Keep in mind we used the sparkle pens for on these ones here, so there's six to choose from. You're getting six in each pack as well. Two for £35 here in the UK or two for $40. Great selection to choose from. Variety of different selections of colours to choose from as well. So they will go on your screen at the moment when it comes to your sparkle pens or you have also got your uh, individual, if you do want to go them individually, $24.99 or $32.95. So what I'm just doing is I'm just die cut those bits just there and I'm just adding them in. But, yeah, special offer when it comes to the sparkle pens, two for £35 or two for $40. Right, so what we're going to do is just pop that just there. What I would suggest, because you have got that great selection of different colours, if you can, if you could then push to go for uh, all six sets, think of one, the incredible saving that you're going to get, but then also just think of uh, all the different uh, times of the years that you're going to be able to cover with all the different colours that you've got as well. Mix and match them when it comes to your... Um, uh, obviously your glitter cards, but what you could then do is do techniques, yes, with your watercolour card, which would work perfectly for, but of course then use your techniques with your smooth cards, because you could still colour in uh, your images and that if you so wish. So all that I'm just doing is we're just going to, I'm not going to peel all these off, but we're just going to start to add our sentiment, just like that. Then we're just going to pop these ones on. Congratulations on. Now, I know by now so many, I'll have so many of our uh, Crafter's Companion uh, sentiment dies. So I've just used these small ones, but you could be using large ones if you want. Congratulations on your. Now, I've used uh, the baby blue for this one here. If you want to use your baby pink glitter card, which also comes within the actual bundle, then you can be using that. You colour coordinate it as well. Or you might want to keep it Christmas with the uh, Christmas greens. So there we go, just finishing that off. The tacky glue isn't quite just holding just yet, so I'll hold that just to the back, but that lets you see where we have then pop that sentiment so that's one of the sentiments as well you've got your two bundles to choose from it's the little things in life that works perfectly 
for your baby card. We have used the shaker card elements as well as the uh, sparkle pens. So there we go. That's another one that you could use. So we have used the glitter card. We've used the sparkle pens. We have used uh, the uh, watercolor card. We've used some of the uh, smooth card stock. We've used the finesse ink pad, and we've also used there was something else we used on that one there. Uh, the stamps, the stamp sets as well. So we've used so many of the products that are on cartload tonight within that one uh, demo. Right, let's go back to Facebook, see what everyone's saying. Let's go down just that wee bit more. Oh, so now again, if you're just tuning in, it is National Pie Day. So in case you wonder why we're talking about pies, that is why. We've got uh, Denise's saying rhubarb and lemon meringue. Hmm, I think that would be quite nice. Uh, we've got many saying that uh, you're loving uh, the cards we'll be making. Thank you very much. Um, you've got uh, Darla saying, uh, loving the shaker card. Uh, you've popped them into your basket. Excellent. Um, now, the deals do run for 48 hours, but it's while stocks last. So, so many of you are already either popping them into your basket or actually so many have already checked out your basket. If you've still got them into your basket, do get them checked out now so then you know that they are secure. It is limited, 48 hours to go or until stocks last. So, get them checked out now. Then we've got... Um, Donna is just saying, easel cards give me an issue. Well, hopefully, if you um, follow what I just done there, there is a video on our YouTube. I believe it's myself where uh, I've done an easel card. So go across there and have a look. So there we go. Let's have uh, a wee bit of a recap of everything that we've done and shown so far on Cartload. Right, so here we go. We have the Gemini. We are used the Gemini Junior within this one here. So Gemini Junior die cutting and embossing machine. So you've got 20% off on this one here. Everything that we've used when it comes to the dies tonight, we've used the Gemini Junior. £111.50 here in the UK. $159.50 in the United States. That's where it's giving you the 20% off. You can do your die cutting through it. You can do your embossing through it. You can do your uh, mixed media dies. You can do your fabric dies. Anything like that. All with a Gemini Junior. You have been loving this one. It may say Christmas, it may be themed Christmas, but you have still been buying them. You've still been checking out your baskets because you're getting a whopping 60% off. You've got your two collections to choose from, £15.50 per collection or $20.50 per collection. That is where your saving of 60% comes from. Now, you might be wanting to uh, pop them into what's coming up right now. There we go. If you're out on the go, or maybe you just want to be able to feel it about your house, or maybe you don't actually want to use it for your crafting, you want to use it for your food shopping. You can do it, so it's entirely up to you. You've got your Gemini wheelie bag, so you've got all these adjustable storage shelves. You've got the actual th uh, 360 degree wheels. You've got the pockets. You've got the zips. You've got your uh, wipeable. $71.50 here in the UK, $95.50. 50 in the United States, saving of 20%. Then, we've been using the sparkle pens time and time again tonight on uh, Cartload, uh, just as well, because you've been popping them into your basket. You are loving them. Many have been uh, going uh, and popping them all into your basket. Well done, you. $24.99 each, or $32.00 each or what you're going to do is you're going to get two sets for £35 or two sets for $40. Just quickly you can choose from Coastal Cottage, Autumn Winter, Floral Gardens, Nature Trail, Spring Summer and win Vintage Tones. So six in each pack, you've got the six to choose from, that's where you can choose your two. Then moving on to, we've got Chloe. So we've got Chloe who actually designs and uh, comes out with these incredible designs and dies. First, for cartload, we've got these ones. So you've got your saving of 20%. Prices range from $7.99 here in the UK or $7.96. So we've got the butterflies. Have a look onto the website. You're going to see so much detail about these ones just here. But these are also the flowers. So you can choose from your summer blossom die set or your uh, summer blooms. So within these ones are $7.99 ranging from $7.99 .99 onwards or $7.96 onwards. Saving of 20%. Hokey dok. Right, there we go. Taking a drink. 
Facebook has gone crazy tonight. Thank you so much for joining me. I am, of course, looking at the feed on uh, Craig Laird Crafters Companion. Uh, but whether you're watching on a Crafters Companion uh, Facebook feed, it might be our US of A feed, you might be watching on YouTube, or if you are watching across on uh, Crafters TV, then that is the best way to do it because you can then shop without any interruptions. You don't have to do that, you know, closing the different screens and going to check out and forgetting your card number and all that sort of stuff. You can be watching while you buy. Right. Think of it, actually, and actually it's not my idea, this is uh, Laura's idea. Think of it as like your personal shopper. So you could be sitting, cup of tea at the side, Thursday night, some of you might have a glass of wine or a beer, then good for you, I wish I could join you. Uh, you can be uh, just doing that, sitting back, relaxing, watching, and also shopping at the exact same time with no interruptions at all. Uh, kicking off the start of your weekend with a lot of crafty fun. Right, let's go straight on. For the first for cartload, we've got tonight so we have got her uh, chloe products so remember we've got the selection so it's kind of like your two separate selections but the prices uh, range of each product from 7.99 here in the uk or 7.96 in the uh, us of a go across to the website on uh, the cartload section you're going to see all about these products so let's do the butterfly so let's go straight to the stamp set first so we have got all these butterflies so remember everything that i'm showing you each the prices start from 7.99 uh, in the UK or $7.96 in the United States. Right, so we've got these butterflies, we've got these swirls, we've got all these sentiments as well. So all the actual uh, stamps, the butterflies, you've got all these different designs within the middle. But what you're going to find as well, we've got these individual dies. So it might look all as one, but they are individual. You can layer them over the top of your stamped, uh, uh, your stamped butterfly and then that will die cut. Then we've also got your panel. So this is, um, if you uh, know us at Crafters Companion with our Edgeable, it's along the exact same line. You have got your detailed butterfly in the middle, which again, you can stamp the actual uh, design within the middle. Uh, but then you've also got your two outside cutting edge. Use it as one, use it as a separate, create your Edgeable. You can be doing that as well. Then we've got the summertime bloom. So again, same ideas. So you've got your butterfly, uh, your um, flowers, you've got your leaves, you've got your uh, sentiments as well. Then you have got your individual flowers. So these all die cut individually, matching the actual stamp set. Or you've got your edgeable there. So once again, you can stamp the stamps with into the middle and then you can just pop them out. So that is those ones. Let's show you how they work. I've got mine set up ready to the side here. So what we're then just going to do is, if I take mine, I've got all my wee individual bits just here. So let's take this one here. So we've got, if I just quickly show you, I'll show you up above just there. So this is where we have got that detail. So we've got that detailed die, so that stays within your cardstock and you've got your two outside cutting edges. But we don't want that, we just want that inside part. So what I'm going to do is pop that onto the top. Let's then bring in our plate. So I'm just using, once again, Gemini Junior for this one. So popping that on in place, just like so. Then what I'm going to do is just tape that down just lightly. Then we're going to run that through like so. Then what I'm going to do is bring in the stamp set. We're also going to use the stamping platform. We're also going to use the black finesse ink pad as well. So then what we're going to do, bring in all these in. So if I then remove that gently, now look at all this detail. Look at the flower and the leaves. They all stay in place. So the outside die cut, but then the center actually stays in place as well. So if you have a look at that one just there, so you can see, you can actually see through the back that the flowers actually stay in place as well as the leaves. So what I'm then going to do is I'm just going to stamp the one just to show you, but then what we're going to do is take in, let's go for this middle flower just here. So we're going to take the matching stamp. So when it comes to the large flower head, they've got, you've got two designs, you've got, this very light veiny leaf one, or you've got this dotty one. So all that I'm just going to do is place that into the middle, just like that. Then what I'm just going to do is if I then just bring in my ink pad, and then what I'm just going to do is pop our ink pad. So I've got my black finesse one, because you can go over and uh, color them if you want. Don't forget the finesse black ink pad is available on Cartload tonight. So all that I'm just going to do is I'm just going to line my head over the top 
And when I think that that is kind of lined up just like that, I'm then going to just press. Then I'm going to then move that out the way. So if I bring that close up for you to see, we've now stamped over that die cut. However, if I pop all these out, that flower stays in place, but we've now got that stamped detail. So then all that you would need to do is bringing in your glitter card. So I've used the lilac glitter card. Just do a bit of matting and layering. Color all these elements in once you've stamped them using your sparkle pens. That will then give you that. So bringing that in close up. So all that I've just done is just stamp them all. Then what we've done is all these individual flowers, once again, I stamped and then just popped them out. Then the same idea with the butterflies, just uh, stamp them, die cut them, and then even the sentiment comes within the stamp set. So you can be creating that. So you've got all these layered flowers that stay in place, but all that glisten from the actual sparkle pens are coming through when it comes onto that panel. So there we go. So, what we can then do when it comes to the actual die set you have got your individual flower stamps so you could be uh, creating your individual flowers if you got our uh, forming tools from uh, flowers uh, the flower form and then of course you could be shaping your flowers with these ones here you've got that border die as well so you can cut into your card out your card create the edgeable if you want and then you've also got these individual stamp set as well that you could be using them on the road so everything that i've showed you whether it's the flowers whether it's the butterflies each individual product arranged from 7.99 here in the uk seven dollars 96 in the united states that's giving you the saving of 20 percent if you want a lot more uh, information when it comes to obviously that stamp set from chloe or the die sets go across to our website crafters combine.co.uk.com or .eu and you'll find them all at the top when it comes to car load. Right, let's have another look to see. Uh, we've got Jeffrey saying uh, combining both sets is outstanding. Thank you very much. Goes to show you that you can mix and match the flowers with the butterflies. Uh, Linda saying gorgeous flowers. Uh, Melanie saying that's beautiful. You'd love in uh, the Chloe uh, product. I knew that you would. Uh, then we've got uh, Maria's just saying love Chloe's die sets make elegant cars. Absolutely. You know if you've any seen if you've seen any of Chloe's uh, samples that she made using her products, they are absolutely incredible. Uh, we've got uh, James is saying, I'm having an argument with a hot glue gun. Well, I hope you win that argument, but do take care because it is hot. Uh, we've then got uh, Marie uh, is saying, oh, thank you, saying uh, love all your demos. Thank you very much, Marie. I appreciate that. Uh, Melanie is saying, uh, you're watching from Atlanta. You're loving the show. Thank you so much. Christine is saying, sweet potato pie is always good. Never tried that one. I never tried that one. Uh, Laura's liking that one. She's liking that one. Uh, Aileen is saying mincemeat pie with real venison. <sighs> oh, and perhaps a bit of whiskey for flavour. Mm, absolutely. Once again, with Laura, just take out the mincemeat and the venison. It's the whiskey. I should put it in the glass. Uh, then we've got um, Denise is also saying, um, if I didn't already have these dyes, uh, I'd be buying them after your demos. Thank you so much. That's what it's all about at Cartload, uh, whether it's myself, whether it's the two Debbies, Fiona, it could be Jan, it could be Lizzie, Bernie, Sarah, Leanne. It's all about one, giving you the absolute best deal possible, the best bundles possible sarah and leanne with the team get together and they make sure that they can try and get the absolute best you can see from tonight we've got absolutely incredible prices and bundles whether you're getting additional products whether you're getting the bundles together whether you're getting 20 percent off whether you're getting 60 percent off there's so much more that goes into cartload so this is why we love it and it gives us the chance to kind of show you what you can be doing with them as well right so Right, I'm being told in my ear, you are all loving this fairy garden 12 by 12 paper pad. Now, one of the reasons you might be loving this, one of many reasons, but you may have already got the full collection when it came to fairy garden. So you'll still have the dies, you'll still have the stamps, you'll still have the embossing folders, but you'll maybe may have run out of the paper pad. So this is where you want to stock up. 40 sheets, 180 GSM, double sided, 12 by 12, all part of the fairy garden. So as you can see through here, so this all includes special glitter effects. It's sort of like an encapsulated glitter. So they're double-sided, as I say. Many of them on one side, I've got like a scene, garden scene, could be the fairies. But then on the other side, we have got the background design, 
and it's got that sort of encapsulated glitter. Look at that shimmer all the way through. So if you like glitter on your card, but you don't like using it, here we go, it's all done for you. Three sheets of each, but look at all these different effects you've got. Look at that. So there we go, look at all these. So pastels with the pink, you've got your uh, purples, you've got your lilacs, you've got your yellows, all these colours as well. Look at these patterns, look at that one there, dotty. But that one has also got your encapsulated dots on there as well. So you can see so many all the way through the 12 by 12 paper pad. And you've also got your toppers as well, right towards the back there. You've got your die cut toppers that gives you the frames. You've got sentiments as well all within that one 12 by 12 paper pad. £10 here in the UK, $11.50 in the United States. Right, let's have a look. Let's go back and have a look at the portable tote within this one here. Right, you're loving this one, which I'm not surprised because this is such a handy one because obviously you can carry it. It's got the handle. It's got a good grip handle. I've got that perfect stitching all the way around to make it sturdy. sturdy. Again, it's wipeable. So you can see all these pockets all the way around. But then if I open this up, so what you've got is, let's bring it that way. So there we go. We've then bringing that in. So you've got your two base platforms. So if I push them down, that gives you that sturdy bit. Once again, what you've got is you've got this wee divider just here. So you can have it full or you can split it if you want. You've got all these elasticated hoops just there. So if you've got your sparkle pens, it could be your alcohol pens. It could be your spritzer tool, your scissors, anything like that. You could be holding them in. Two pockets at that side just there. So you've got your clear pockets, two separate ones side by side. Then you've got your three pockets at that side just there, all elasticated, all holding it into place. Again, if you just want to hold the plates on their own, not the machine, they will hold your plates as well. But good one to have all your essentials when it comes to Crafter's Companion or any of your other crafting tools. Entirely up to yourself, but that's a good one for you to have. And I'm not surprised it's been popular tonight on Cartload. 19.50 here in the UK or $15.50 in the United States. So you're getting the, the saving of 20%. Kidok, right. Karma stamp and die set. So you're going to be seeing that one just coming up in a short moment. There we go, having a look right down the bottom just here. So let's have a look and show you what these are. So let's have a look at all that in detail. So here we go, up at the top just here. So this is your stamp. So this is what will stamp out just like that. So here we go, 35% off on this one, £8 here in the UK, $12.50. So stamp that out, then you've got all these layering dies just here. So you've got one, you've got two, you've got three, you've got four, just there. So what we've got just onto that one there, stamp it out, then you can choose all the different layers that you want to layer up with. So having a look just here, so if I tip that back forward, look at this one here. So you can stamp out one level, there's another level, and then further in that way, there's the middle level. But look at this one just here. So if I tip that up, that is now all layered up. It's 3D. So we've got all three layers, or you could do two layers. You might just want all three. You could uh, cut, you can colour, use your sparkle pens on these ones. So many different ways. So what we're going to do is, let's take my set. We're going to do a, bit, a quick bit of stamping, quick bit of colouring just to show you. So what I'm going to do is let's bring in my stamp set, just like this. Then what we're going to do is take our uh, stamping platform. So peel that off. Just take that off. Don't be scared to take them off. Peel that off. Get that off. There we go. Right, taking our uh, stamping mat and also our stamping platform. Popping that just into the middle just there. So this is the Karma one. Very symmetrical in all these different shapes within this one. So we're going to use our Noir Black. So I'm just going to stamp that. This is such a lovely design. I'm a big fan of symmetrical. I do like symmetrical things. But this one has got nice areas to colour, whether it's fine tip pens, whether it's going to be your tri-blend pens. If you've been following me on social media, you can uh, you know I'm absolutely loving my tri-blend pens at the moment, using them every time I can. But what I am going to do is use our sparkle pens because we've got them on um, cartload tonight. So stamping, like so. There we go. Now look at that. Look at the design, look at the image. So between, yes, our stamping, our stamping mat, but with our ink, the finesse ink, look how crisp and clean that is. 
Now, what I'm just going to do is, uh, I'm not going to spend a lot of time, but we're just going to take uh, some of our sparkle pens. Just give them just a wee bit of a shake. So this one will be the summer uh, collection. So there you go, just at the side there, sparkle pens, um, two for £35 uh, or two for $40, wherever you are. So we're just going to take one of the colours just here. So all that I'm just going to go and just do is just colour them just in. Nice fine area, uh, lined area to colour in. So I'm just going to go deep. So just look at that. Just look at the colour intensity of that colour coming through. So I'm just going to work my way round just like that. Now, what you can do is you can then just um, do a bit of heat embossing if you wanted. So that waterproof ink pad that I used earlier on, check out uh, Crafters Companion website for that. But do any heat embossing, black outline, that would look incredible with your sparkle pens or any of your other uh, alcohol marker pens. It could be that you're using your aqua markers if you've got them at home. Just have a look, do different effects, do your water techniques, your water distress background techniques when it comes to uh, these ones. So let's just colour this one in as well. So think of the fun that you could be having. If you love your zentangling, this is such a lovely one to do your zentangling with. Some nice full on opened area shapes, but there's some really fine detailed ones as well. So let's just colour this one in as well. So look how this is coming along just beautifully. So I'm just going to, I need to, otherwise I'll So what I'm going to do is work my way around just like so. And I'm just going to fill these in just like that. There we go. So then what we could then do is let's go for, go for the bright yellow one, sunshine on this one just here. And then we're just going to colour this one in. So let's go at the ones in between. But you can mix and match. You can do, choose to do whichever colour design that you want. It's entirely up to you. If you like to do your shading, if you like to do your colouring or your shading with your HB pencils, think of the different effects that you can get with that one so many different ways. Heat embossing onto your acetate. And then what you could do, this was actually a question that came up onto my Facebook yesterday. As you'll have known, I was across in Germany. Oh, look at that, I've just bled over, but not to, like, I mean bleed, bled over as in picked up the colour, not actually bled, just in case anyone, it actually looks quite nice, doesn't it? Just in case anyone thinks I actually meant, I've cut myself, I haven't. Um, yeah, what uh, many of you all have noticed, actually I'm just going to keep blending that in. Uh, I was uh, crossing Germany with Debbie Fisher yesterday, but one of the questions I had on my Facebook was um, a lady, I do apologise, I can't remember your name, but asked about using the sparkle pens onto acetate. So what you could do is do this technique, use your uh, embossing powder, black embossing powder and heat onto your acetate. Then what you would do is pop some of your sparkle pen color onto your glass mat, then use some of your tacky glue, mix it together, and then using one of our paint brushes, just color in all of the different areas using your, um, well, your sparkle medium that's now been mixed with a bit of tacky glue and that will then enable you to pop it onto your acetate. So that was one that I wasn't sure of, I hadn't heard of. So having uh, Fiona and Jan uh, on the team who absolutely loves uh, the Spectrum Noir range, I went and uh, gave them a shout and asked them. So what I'm going to do, so if I, let's bring that in a bit closer because my mistake has actually looked quite smart. So there we are, I colored each individual one, but can you see there, because you can blend with them, you can blend with them, but see how my yellow seeped into the red. Now, I didn't mean to do that, however, look at that flame effect that you've got, and look at that sparkle still coming through all the reds, all of the yellows, and even that oranges. So you could carry on and you could keep going all these different colors, all these different ways, and um, just have some fun and do whatever pleases you. It's very soothing to do coloring, but it's an even soother effect seeing that sparkle and glitter coming through. So what we could do is, keeping in mind you can then just carry on, but then the idea of these ones are to take your die. So for this one here, we're just going to use the outside die. And what did I do my low tack tape? Let's tape this one down. Again, low tack tape you will get within that essential bundle. 
So that will no doubt come up shortly on your screen. But I'm just going to tape that down. So you've got your essential bundles. This is where you're getting three rolls of your low tack tape. You're getting your six inch scissors and you're also going to be getting your edge crimpler. Now, what I'm just going to do, uh, they will go 25% off. They will go along the bottom of your screen just there. £15 or $22.50. So I'm just going to pop that into place, just lining that up um, like so. And then let's tape that down. I'm just going to pop that on, pop that on. If you are a bit worried or scared about doing them together, you can do them individually if you so wish. Right, let's take my Gemini plates. What do I do with them? Here we go. And then we're just going to run this through the Gemini Junior. Now, I've just used the two die sets within this one. We've still, actually, there we go. Let's just, very quickly, let's just add that one on. May as well do all three, just like so. Placing that on, like that. And we're going to tape that down, like so. And we've even still got a very small one within the middle that you could be using if you want. So let's run this through. This is a great one where, depending on the layers that you cut, you can create the outline, you can create frames, you can create inner pads, you can create decoupage, you can create shaker cards. So many different ways, just by giving you those dies that you can create your own uh, die cut layers. So let's pop all these out. So. I, you would be a lot careful than I am, but let's just peel them away. So there's the aperture that you've got just in there. You could create a shaker card if you want. So let's peel all these off. So if I take these off like this, so there we go. There is one layer, like so. So we've got that layer. Then we've got this next layer, very much like a teardrop or even a, a bobble effect. Look at that layer just there. And then we've even still got this middle layer just like this. There we go. So have a look at that. There we go. There we are. So there we go. All the different things that you could be using, die cutting, creating, stamping, colouring, when it comes to that stamping die set there. So that is the Karma one. I don't know why, but I just think that name is very funny for a, a die set. Karma one, all these different ways and different elements that you can do. Now, we've showed you a lot of dies as the, uh, and stamps when it comes to the actual um, sets and die ranges at Crafters Companion. You might want somewhere to store them. Of course, we've had the actual storage bags, but we've also got some of the storage folders. So we've got the lie, die, and uh, st stamp storage folders. So within these ones here, you're getting 10% off. So each one is going to be £17.50 here in the UK or $24 in the United States. So we've got these large ones just here. Have a look. So look at the size of that one. So this is where we've got the large ones. So you've got, if you can have a look inside, let's have a look at this one. So we've got obviously the folder. So up above, so you've got your folder, then let's open this one up so we can find that in just here. So this is going to hold your uh, panels. So you don't get these ones, um, so a stamp storage folder. But what you can then just do is go to the website, buy your actual panels and it can hold, you get your magnetic ones, you can pop into your folders, they'll hold your dies, and you also get these ones here that will hold all of your stamps as well, your cling stamps. So I'm not surprised that this is busy. We've not actually even um, shown these on Cartload tonight, and already apparently it's uh, busy on the website for them ones, I'm not surprised. So if you do want all those inserts to go inside, you don't just have to use them for your uh, die and stamp storage. If you just want to use them as a ring binder or that, then you can do it if you like many of you like the crafters companion brand and just love to use them in different ways then you can do but the perfect way to be storing all of your uh, dies and stamps uh, to make sure that they don't get damaged at all right now talking of dies have a look at this we've got the gemini the element words and die bundle check that out save 45%, not quite 50%, but just about there within this one there. You can choose from the Love Heart, Wedding Chimes, or, and Daisies. So that's the first three. Or in the next bundle, you can choose, say, or the next bundle, you're getting Element Swans, Fancy Bow, and Shoot for the Stars. Two bundles to choose from, £13 in the UK, $21 in the United States. 
States, this is where you're getting your saving of 45%. These create unbelievably elegant, detailed wraparound dies for your cards, or it could be home decor, such as it could be any of your... Um, Oh, what would you call them? Napkins. That's the word I was trying to think. Anything to go around napkins, you could be doing that one. So let's have a look at the first bundle on this one here. So let's have a look. So we're going straight in with these ones here. So this is the first one to choose from. You're getting all three. You're getting love hearts on these ones here. Two separate dies, but we'll show you them just shortly. Then you've got your wedding chimes. Exactly that, all about weddings. Doesn't just have to be weddings. And then we've got daisy delights on that one here. So that's the first bundle. Two die, die sets in each, £13, $21. Or bundle two, you have got £13. Once again, $21. You get in the... Uh, Elegant swans on that one just there. You're getting the fancy bows on that one just there. And then you've also got shoot for the stars. So there we go. So that is your uh, different ones you've got on these ones just there. Uh, Wedding Chimes apparently is doing, uh, doing the best. It is in the lead. Um, perfect time of the year for getting ready for all the weddings that will be coming up. So that is your two um, bundles uh, within your wrap dies. So let's show you a few things that you could be making. So let's pull out just a few. So this is where they can wrap around. So here we go. So this one here is your love heart. So what happens is once you've die cut them, you then actually create sort of like a slot with a fold in so you can either wrap around just like so. So if I just tuck them in, of course, I'm doing that back to front, upside down, or you can just slide up and down if you want. There we go. Now, this really is the perfect addition to any of your cards, but then what you'll find is each of the dies, they don't have an end cutting line, so you can make this as long as you want. Perfect for Valentine's Day coming up in, well, uh, what, about three weeks after that? Yeah, three weeks time. So you got your Valentine's there. You can then uh, do your inking techniques. You can colour it with your sparkle pens if you want. You can be doing that one. Even just on our glitter card, we've got the swans on that one there. This is actually using the watercolour card. Just goes to show you can use your watercolour card for die cut and not just colouring. But once again, they actually slot in together and you can create your cards. There we go. So what we can do is show you how they work. So the idea is they actually work perfectly to go around your uh, A6 card. So your really small card just like this. So what you'll find is on the back, you have got measurements. We've got the measurements just here. So if I turn this one back around, we're going to use the love hearts on this one. So you're going to see, where are we? Right, just down there. So I know it's really quite small, but it does give you the measurements uh, just there for uh, the size that you want to cut. So what we need for this one just here to create the wraparound card to fit an A6 card, that size that we just showed you a moment ago, is uh, going to be uh, 269 millimeters by 48 millimeters. So I've got my card uh, strip all ready to go just here. So then what we're going to do is bringing in our two dies. So we've got our two dies just here. However, there's not a cutting edge right at the very end just there. So if I bring that in close, where my nail is, there's not actually a cutting edge there. So that's going to stay in place. So then what I'm going to do is take my low tack tape and we're just going to pop that in place. So we're going to pop this hard at this side. So as you can see, if I bring that in that way, you're going to see that this cuts to the size that I just said a moment ago for this one, fits that one just perfectly from top to bottom on this one here. So it's love hearts, so it's weddings, it's Valentine's Day. It could be if you want to color coordinate it, it could be for a new baby if you want, it could be anniversary, it could be any time of the year, it could be for a christening, it could be anything like that. Just doesn't have to be all about the love. So what I'm going to do is tip that up so you can see. So we've got that right to the edge there and we've taped it down. And we've got it right to the edge there and taped it down just like that. So what we're then going to do is bring in my Gemini Junior plates. Now, what did I do with them? I did have them. I did have them. What did I do? I've lost them. How can I lose my plates? What's, what have I done? What have I done? Plates. Don't know what I've done with my plates. So do you know what we do? To show you, you can still use your Junior or your, your actual Gemini Mini. So what we're going to do is pop that on. So there we go. 
So I'm just popping that one out just to let you see, you can still do all these sorts of uh, techniques using these small die cutting machines. So we're just going to go one way and then we're going to reverse back. So then, if I then bring that one off, so if I then just take that excess off, look at that. So that's die cut in place, that stayed in, but we've got that die at that side. So then let's flip and rotate our folder. Let's just line that up once again, and then we're going to run this through. This is a good way just to explain if you've got any of our long dies in that as well. It goes to show you don't necessarily just have to use the junior or the large Gemini. If you don't need to use that full platform, then use the mini. So there we go. Once again, let's peel that off, and then we're just going to flick all that excess out. So let's just, to show you that full effect, let's just get rid of these, just so you can see how gorgeous this is. Now I've used on this one a watercolour card, because you could come across and colour it with sparkle pens, do your techniques. Use your smooth white card sort if you want. Why not use the glitter card? The glitter card we've got on Cartload tonight, where you're getting all those packs die cut just beautifully, so you could be using them if you so wish. So there we go, so that's us now got our uh, die cut parts on that panel. So of course you're going to say, well, what are you going to do with that bit, Craig? So what we're then going to do, use your um, scissors, just like this, or what you can do is if you've got your ruler and your craft knife, then obviously you could be cutting along. But I am, just for speed tonight, I'm just going to use the scissors. I'm just going to use the six inch ones. We've got them on cartload tonight. So I'm just starting at one end and I'm just joining up those two and just slotting them side by side. Once again, I'm just going to start there, work my way along and just join them up like that. That will now give us our full uh, banner. And there we go. Some may call it a belly band. So then all that we're just going to do now is we're just going to fold that over and then just slot them in half. So there we go. So that is where that gives you that wrap round die like that. But just goes to show that if you had even longer cardstock, maybe you had A3, if you make that width to the, what was it, 48 millimetres, but the length could be as long as you want. So you can still do it around scrapbook pages and that if you've got that really long. But there you go. So there was a wee impromptu show of how you can use the Gemini Go if you so wish. So there we go. Your two bundles to choose from. £13 here in the UK, $21 in the United States, giving you 45%. Once again, I've kind of forgotten uh, to say this tonight, but everyone across in Europe, all your prices are on the website too. Right, let's rewind all the way back. Let's have a look and see what we've been showing you tonight on Cartload. Right, so many you seem to be uh, popping them into your basket. I am not surprised. This is our large die and stamp storage folder. Hold your dies, hold your stamps. £17.50 here in the UK, $24 in the United States. This is giving you a saving of 10%. Then we've got, this is, right, so Laura's just told me this is the most popular item of the evening. I do believe it's because many of you've still got all your uh, die and folder sets. You're uh, buying them, more than one of them apparently, I'm not surprised. £10, $11.50 in the United States, 20%. This is your Fairy Garden 12 by 12, 40 sheets, paper panned, 180 GSM. And to complement that, you might want this. We've got a glitter card, so this includes your glitter patch. So you get your baby blue, baby pink, you get your copper lilac, solar gold, Christmas green, saving of over 35%, £15 here in the UK, $23 in the United States. Then we're getting the finesse uh, ink pads on this one here. We showed you them earlier on. So if you want to colour in either with your uh, sparkle pens, it could be your aqua pens, your tribaline pens, classics, anything like that, use your finesse ink pads with these ones here. £14.96 in the UK, $22.47 in the United States, a saving of over 60% off on our tri on our tri blend on our finesse ink pads, 60% off. Then we showed you these right at the very beginning. These are a clear, I can never say that, can I? Clear acrylic stamp collection. You've got two, two bundles to choose from. £7 in the UK, $8.50 in the United States, saving at 25%. Really cute, really nice, really funky, sentimental sentiment stamps within these ones to have a bit of fun with. 
There we go, and uh, yes, this will be the last time I mention these, but I wanted to really, really express how um, how good that these are, how good the deal is within these ones here. This is your Spectrum Noir uh, Sparkle Pen, so you're getting six to choose from. You're getting six in each pack. Last time, you've got the Coastal Cottage, Autumn Winter, Floral Garden, Nature Trail, Spring Summer, and Vintage Tones. $24.99 here in the UK, $32.95 in the US of A. However, if you're in the UK, you can choose two for £35, or if you're in the United States, you can choose two for $40. Now, you've just uh, been loving these ones. So this one here, this is your Deluxe Tote. This actually holds your Gemini Junior. It'll also hold your plates. It'll hold the cords as well as all these additional pockets. You can see within uh, the screen just there, we've used them to pop crafty bits. Saving a 20%, £27.50 here in the UK, $31.50 in the United States. A good way to get crafting on the go. Then for the first time ever on Cartload, we had uh, Chloe tonight. So we've got the range of products from the butterflies as well as the uh, flowers coming up in a moment. But these prices all range from $7.99 here in the UK, $7.96 in the United States. You've got your stamp, you've got your individual dies, you've got your actual die panel that cuts into your card, out of your card, creates a border, creates a matte and layer. So many different ways to use them. However, the way to use all of these it's with the Gemini Junior. This is the Gemini Junior saving of 20% off. You've got the Gemini Junior, you've got the plates, you've got 3D embossing folders, credit card dies, actual dies, so much more within that one bundle. Perfectly, I know it's January, I know this is the 23rd, I know it feels like November already because it's been such a long month. However, do treat yourself for 20% off, £111.50, £150 dollars 50 in the united states that's where you're saving a 50 percent 50 percent 20 percent comes 20 percent just to confirm 20 percent saving on the gemini right then we've got these ones here yes they are christmas but one two three four of them you could be using all time of the year we showed you and stocking where we made a new baby card within this one here two bundles to choose from uh, you are 15 pounds here in the UK, $20.50 in the United States, a saving of 60% on these ones here. You've got your dies, you've got your stamps, the actual dies enable you to create shaker cards. To create the shaker cards, you're going to need these. Now, yes, you can be using salt, you can be using glitters, you can be using all these different mediums to pop into your actual cards to create the shaker element, but the best way, in my opinion, to create the shaker element is using these incredible sequence and then these ones. You're getting them all this one here, you're getting the silver, you're getting the red, you're getting the gold, you're getting the green, and you're getting the blue. That's not the actual names, all the actual names are on the screen just there, but they are 50 grams in total in each bag. £11.50 in the UK, $15.80 in the United States, saving of 50 per oh, Why have I got 50% in my head? Saving of 20%, 20%, 20%, saving of 20%. If you do have your double-sided adhesive background sheets, you can then just pour the actual sequence over the back, and that will give you a sequence background and trust me you're not actually going to be using as much sequence by doing that as you think now check out your baskets many of you already have thank you so much you are going to absolutely love what you've purchased tonight many of you have been stocking up on many things many of you just been stocking up on obviously the paper pad with the uh, fairy garden but you've been popping in the smooth card stock you've been popping in the watercolor card seeing the different techniques that you can be doing get across to the website if you're watching um from uh, crafters tv you can check that out right now while watching if you are of course watching from facebook you're watching from youtube then uh, do uh, get on and check that out if you are doing it that way the best way to do it is maybe just watch on your ipad and check out on your phone or the other way around these are going to last for 48 hours well stock remaining if they do last so many popular items the actual storage bags and bundles, and they've been really popular as well tonight. Been really, uh, really popular. One of the most popular, if not the most popular, is the 12 by 12 Fairy Garden Paper Pad. You're loving that one there. As you can see, we're going into the springtime, so perfect for all these different colours that you can be creating when it comes to your cards. The glitter card as well, that's another popular one as well. Keeping in mind that the 
uh, Fairy Garden is relatively new. It only came out at the end of last year, but about November time with Jan, she launched it here in the UK. That would uh, work perfectly with the glitter card, which also is kind of relatively new. That came around towards the end of, well, uh, I think it was the last HSN uh, show with Sarah. And then it would also work perfectly whether it's your shaker cards, your shaker dice, anything like that. Right, let's have another quick look at Facebook before we bid goodbye uh we've got uh karen is saying great show thank you so much carol is saying that was very elegant thank you very much um then we have got uh another carol saying absolutely beautiful jeffrey is saying um jeffrey shepherd pie is delicious so many of you are watching on facebook tonight lots of love coming from facebook hello to you lot as well so good to be able to interact on facebook um, James is saying we'll have a look at the uh, CC gun. Do have a look at that. That's obviously the hot glue gun. Different ways, different uh, ways to adhere your cards if you so wish. Uh, then we've also got uh, Suzanne is saying love the fairy garden paper pad. Just had to get it. Well done. You're not going to regret that one. Maybe you've already had it. Um, Carol is just saying homemade spaghetti bolognese. I'm hoping you're not actually meaning to put that into a pie as much as I do love spaghetti bolognese. Uh, cheese and potato pie, pecan pie. Uh, yeah, so many are loving your pies. If you are just catching right at the very end there, it is National Pie Day. That's why we've been talking about pie. If you did miss any of Cartload tonight, do go back right to the very start once we finish. Watch uh, back over again. Stock up on any of the deals for the next 48 hours. 48 hours. Or while stocks last. But until... Saturday. We're going to see you then. Don't forget myself and Sarah are going to be back on Saturday with the next HSN preview. That's right. We're going to be showing you so many new launches. Sarah's going to be launching next week on HSN. I cannot wait. I love doing the previews with Sarah. It's going to be so much fun. So until then, I will say good night. Welcome to Club Inspire, our free loyalty club. As a member of the club, you can save up to 20% every time you shop with us. For every pound you spend, whether it's in one of our stores or on our website, you'll collect one loyalty point. The more points you have, the more benefits you'll receive. As a welcome present, we'll give you 20% discount with your very first order. Once you place your first order, you'll be given 250 points straight away, making you a bronze member. This will mean that you'll receive a 5% discount on all of your purchases until the end of the next calendar year, plus priority postage. 500 points takes you up to Silver Membership, where you'll get 10% discount, plus free shipping when you spend over £20. When you get to 750 points, you'll become a Gold Member, which gets you a whopping 15% discount on every order, and will ship them to you completely free, no matter how big or small they are. Spend over £25 and we'll send them to you via our premium next day delivery carrier service. When you reach 1500 points, you'll become a Platinum member, giving you the same shipping benefits as a Gold member, but with the added bonus of a massive 20% discount on all of your purchases. Now on top of that, you'll receive exclusive discounts, sneak peeks of brand new products, special offers and money saving vouchers. You'll have access to an exclusive secret Facebook group to meet like-minded friends, to find out information first and to be inspired by all the crafty makes. We'll send you a completely free quarterly Digimag direct into your inbox giving you lots of hints, tips, inspiration, additional offers and some sneaky behind the scenes gossip from the team. So what are you waiting for? Become a member of our club today.